So what's good, TMG fam? It's your boy L, and I'm back with another reaction. How y'all feel? Welcome back to the channel. Salute. Listen, y'all, I am down here currently right now trying to get away from Queen. She is driving everybody in the house crazy right now. Why? Because it's that time of the year, man, when when these certain days come up, Halloween, Thanksgiving, Christmas, all that decorative stuff. She's in like the pre-stages where she's trying to prep. So she wants to, you know, clean, wash walls, uh, baseboards, uh, uh, paint, and all. everybody's running from her, right? <laughs> Me, the boys, everybody like what 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 are we doing even the dogs don't want to be <laughs> even the dogs is running from her like nah, no 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 so yeah man like down here in the basement i was like i gotta go record the boys was like uh uh everybody's trying to find like an excuse right now <laughs> they, everybody's trying to find an excuse but anyway listen the next video we're gonna get into man is uh Weird videos from the foul depths of YouTube. All right. So before we get into it, man, make sure your home is secure. Lock your windows, lock your doors. Make sure everything is secure. If you got a little alarm, put the alarm on. If you got motion sent, put all that stuff on, man. Make sure you're secure. And we're going to get into this video. All right. If you're new to the channel, hit the subscribe button. I appreciate you. And uh, join the fam and join us as we acknowledge the haters. Moment of silence. That's enough. Now run the likes up, baby. Make sure y'all hit that like button. Make sure y'all leave a comment. Let's go. How you doing? I'm Callan and this is Slapped Ham. Today we're looking at some weird videos from the foul depths of YouTube. So hit that subscribe button and strap yourself in for more weird and creepy content just like this. While there are a large number of weird videos uploaded to YouTube, this video, uploaded by user Treats for Beasts, is one of the more unsettling offerings from the site. Perhaps creepier than- I don't even like the title, Plastic Men. <laughs> that could have be interpreted so many different ways. Beasts is one of the more unsettling offerings from the site. Perhaps creepier than found footage videos, this video depicts a flash animated green creature, bent and contorted. The look on the creature's face is one of discomfort as the creature begins to repeat its Now what do you do? You walk in on your kids and they watch something like this and <laughs> you take the TV out of the room. You take the phones, you take all access for them to see this away. You got to, bro. This is crazy. High pitched and wheezing chant over and over again stating Plastic men, women and children want to tickle me in the wilderness. They watch as I caress my exposed spine. I'm ashamed of my own body. As though it wasn't unsettling enough the first time, the creature spends the rest of the video repeating its chant as dramatic organ music plays in the background. Speaking of plastic people, the video cuts to flash drawings of a family with gnarled hands and black eyes, seemingly walking toward the creature in an effort to tickle it as the creature states. The video makes a point to show the viewers the gnarled and exposed flesh of the creature's spine. Just as the viewer begins to get thoroughly creeped out by the creature, it makes a point of lamenting over its hatred of its own body, causing the viewer to feel bad for the poor thing before it begins to repeat its chant over and over again. I probably wouldn't recommend watching this one if you're suffering from a fever. This video appears to begin like any other- Y'all are gonna hear that sound in the back of your head for the next few days. My bad, bro, I didn't know it was gonna be on here. But you're gonna hear that. The whole video on YouTube might. A woman sat in front of the video, confessional style, begins to talk about her recent shopping haul, and things seem as though they're about to proceed as normal. However, the video begins by underlying the sound of water going down a drain behind the woman's words. 
few days ago, I went to the mall and stopped by Zara, and I also went to Love Culture, so I Every photo and bedside lampshade has the same photo of a distraught face. This reminds the viewer that they're actually watching what appears to be one of many videos uploaded to the YouTube channel You Have Schizophrenia. A few days ago, I went to the mall and stopped by Zara. Is it a chipmunk? A voiceover asks, seemingly referencing the woman's high-pitched voice. Is it a chipmunk? In an odd electronica remix, the woman's face is slowly and disturbingly reanimated by the editor. Her mouth begins to move in time with the beat, and her eyes blink unsettlingly. In between going cross-eyed and having her own face replaced by that of another screaming and distressed person. The background begins to distort as the woman's eyes are multiplied and redistributed across her body. Her mouth doubled and moved to the top of her head in a truly trippy fashion. The music continues as the woman's face returns to normal. I do not recommend you watching this video and you are on some type of extracurricular activity or you on, you know what I mean, some substance of maybe some weed or something or a drinking or something like that. This here will freak. It'll make you think you're tripping. It'll make you think you're going through a bad trip. Whatever you're doing. I don't advise watching this, bro. And I wonder if she knew about this. I, I just don't believe she would have approved for this to go down. However, her voice has been chipmunked in order to match the comment made at the beginning of the video, having gone high-pitched and sped up. It seems as though the user may have been attempting to make some commentary on the original video itself, or YouTube hall culture in general. Either way, the video ends with a voice speaking to the user and stating, you have paranoid schizophrenia. You have paranoid schizophrenia. I definitely got something after seeing that. I definitely have picked up something. I don't know if it's schizophrenia, but yeah, after watching that, I would definitely be diagnosed with something. This video uploaded to the YouTube channel, Local 58 Community Television, begins just like any other weather advisory video might, proclaiming a weather warning by the National Emergency Alert System. An unsettling alert sound begins to play. What is not typical for these types of videos is for them to issue oddly galactic warnings for meteorological events. The distorted footage cuts to weird videos from a second camera, seemingly positioned to give viewers a snippet of the meteorological event itself. Close up, the video seems to present a view of an unidentified planet or moon floating in space. The next title card makes sure to warn citizens not to observe the mysterious and unnamed event with their naked eyes, for their own protection. The footage then cuts to a more traditional looking TV schedule, backed by jazzy elevator music. The video is again interrupted by the- Whoa, 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 whoa. what was that about to read out? See if I can catch it. The video. So that said blood, right? Dang it. I can't get it. It said blood something. The video is again interrupted by the emergency alert system. This time displaying the warning civil danger alert with a menacing red background. This warning is unfamiliar and seems more alarming. It's almost as though the network or some other broadcasting entity is attempting to block the flow of emergency information to the general public. As with many emergency situations, specifically extraterrestrial ones, the idea that the government or powers that be are blocking the flow of information is one of the most terrifyingly common theories. Two conflicting messages pass by in quick succession. The first warns civilians not to look at the sky and to not leave their homes. Now, my bad. You received this. Civil danger. Alert. All right. Now you're already panicking, right? 
Then they're going to tell you for your safety, remain indoors. Do not look at the night sky. They might as well tell people to look at the night sky because most people going to go, what do you mean? And go look up. It's feel like, what is it? Bird Box or whatever that movie was. <laughs> Don't open your eyes. That's what this feel like right there. That's what I meant. It, it automatically took me to that movie. Because in the beginning, they didn't know it was what they were seeing. This screen is almost immediately replaced by a correctional screen, informing viewers that the event is actually safe to view and that the warning has been lifted. These conflicting messages make the viewer question what is safe and what is not. Even creepier, the next warning seems to command viewers to go outside now. Viewers, I would be hesitant about that. Go outside now. Why? What is going on? What do you mean? What you, what's happening? Yeah, I would be way, real messed up. Now start to feel as though the feed is being hacked into by some malevolent force without their best interests in mind. The footage continues to cut away to distorted videos with ominous messages that are difficult to make out. The next message that cuts into the footage starts off advising viewers to look at the moon before it's color corrected to warn viewers do not look at the moon. Viewers get the distinct feeling that there are two forces at work in the broadcast, directly at odds with one another. See, at this point, I'm looking at my family, I'm saying, all right, we're going to have to figure this out ourselves or wait for a live feed for somebody to come on there and say something. This following this, this right here, no, it's going to get us killed. The distorted warning continues to advise viewers to stay inside, avoid looking out as well as to avoid mirrors and to avoid looking up. The video cuts back to a warning from the weather service stating, it's in the light. The moon came in, he found me through the mirror, moonlight white, white like eyes, not light, but blood. I drown in him. If you're afraid, we'll look together. Before giving the viewers any time to process this or look away, the footage immediately cuts to a view of the moon, the entity the viewers have been warned not to look at. While this video alone is disturbing enough, this channel as a whole is known for its well-made weird videos. Part of a series composed by Chris Straub, the idea was to create an anthology series of spliced together found footage and emergency alert footage uploaded by the fictional TV station Local 58 WCLV TV. The channel focuses on creating well-made bone chilling horror advisories meant to mimic those created by government authorities or weather stations. As a whole, these videos give sense of what it might be like to experience a worldwide catastrophic event for real. There's quite a few videos on the channel that are well worth checking out. I'll put a link in the description box below. See, this is why we got to prepare and not, not just speaking to y'all, speaking to me too. Be prepared. If you were stuck, if that happens, all of a sudden worldwide catastrophic event happens and you're stuck in your home. Can you survive? How many days can you survive? Huh? Without being able to have delivery services, Uber Eats and all this new stuff now. Like, are you prepared to be able to do that? It's something to put in your brain. That's all I'm saying. When searching YouTube for weird videos, this video uploaded by user Waffle Doodle is one of the more unsettling ones. Depicting a man's face floating against a black screen, the video is flash animated to display various parts of the man's face moving on their own. Whoa. The man's eyes roll back and his mouth opens wide as his eyes turn purely red. Named Woody Scream, the man depicted in the video gives out a piercing otherworldly scream of pain, just as the creepy video cuts to black. I don't understand it, bro. They get us for the smallest thing on YouTube. Y'all ain't never seen me put no content, but I'm constantly being watched and monitored and this, that, and the third. But stuff like this lives on the platform? How? I don't understand that. Focus, y'all. Focus. They need to focus their attention on finding this type of stuff. Yeah. <laughs> 
Y'all gonna see that image in your dreams tonight. Before we get to that number one, remember to hear this scary content. This is just one of many videos uploaded to YouTube as part of the channel Meet Sleep Archives, a channel dedicated to preserving the original works of a channel called Meet Sleep. Over the years, the Meet Sleep channel has gathered thousands of subscribers. The central figure, someone going by the online moniker Meet, has been confusing and scaring people for quite some years. Although the channel as a whole seems to be comprised of at least 11 users, all hailing from different parts of the world. The videos are highly disturbing in nature, many depicting violent acts such as kidnapping, stalking and cannibalism, and are not for the faint of heart. Dedicated viewers of the channel have many theories as to the video uploaders' identities, as well as the origins of the videos. Some believe the videos to have originated from a prank gone wrong, while others believe the disturbing nature of the content to have spawned from Meat himself, deeming him a likely serial killer and cannibal. Over the years, the channel uploaded 91 videos that were taken down and replaced with a singular video entitled No More. As though the channel themselves made an effort to put an end to the disturbing content of their videos. Since then, however, the channel seems to have completely vanished, giving spawn to countless copycat channels. The channel Meet Sleep Archives made sure to back up the original videos and has uploaded them so that fans may continue analysing them. This disturbing found footage video titled Ingrate depicts a dank basement of an unknown location. The voice, perhaps that of Meat himself, assures an unknown person that he has cleaned her and reminds the person over and over that they live there now. You live here. I took you and I keep you warm. Disorienting shots of the basement show a bottle of bleach, a filthy shower, and an ominous black bag about the size of a human body. The rest of the video carries on in a similar fashion, drawing in potential new meat conspiracy theorists bent on discovering the true intentions of the man behind the channel. Those who are a fan of highly disturbing content and willing to put in the work to discover the identity and intentions of the entities behind such disturbing videos will likely enjoy going through the archives of meat content and forming their own theories, as these are some of the creepiest videos on the internet. You live here. I give you a home. If you want more weird clips that we've dug up... Now I see what y'all be doing late at night, what y'all be looking at, bro. <laughs> Nah, don't send me nothing like that at all. I'm still tripping over that worldwide catastrophic event. Blood, and then it says, look outside, don't look outside, don't look at the sky. It's all in a blood red background, like, no, uh uh. Nah, y'all tripping, fam. But at the same time, what do we do? How do we. You know what I'm saying? If something like that happens, what do we do? I know a lot of people reference the zombie apocalypse. They be preparing for that. But are you prepared for other things? I know a lot of people have like their little shelters, their underground little different places that they built and they got it stored with cans and everything. And we look at them crazy, but are they? Are they? They might be a little eccentric, but uh, if something happens, they gonna be well equipped, are we? Just want to put it in the back of your mind. All right, y'all yeah, get at me. Let me know what you think. This was crazy, weird as well, and uh, yeah, let me know. Well, till the next reaction, I'm out. Peace, y'all. Stay solid. A.